Hey everybody, in today's video I'm going to be showing you how you can change your distance units between miles and kilometers depending on your preference. So I'm using the first generation Garmin Instinct Solar. It shouldn't matter whether you've got the solar or one of the non-solar models. This video should work the same for you. I'm also not, I'm using it as delivered from Garmin. I haven't made any adjustments to what any of the keys do. So this is pretty simple. We're going to start by pressing and holding the middle button on the left hand side. And we're going to use the up or down button. In this case it makes more sense to use the up button. We're going to go to settings. We're going to press the GPS button to select settings. And then again, once we're in settings, we're going to use the up or down button to go to system. Press GPS to select system. And then system, we're going to use the up or down button and we are going to go until we see units. Units is going to be the place where you can go change your various variables, your temperature unit, your distance unit, so on and so forth. In this case, the very first one we see is distance. I've got mine set to miles. I'll press GPS to select it and I can choose miles or kilometers. I had one person ask if, they, if you can change it to feet. You can't change it to feet. These are your only two options is miles or kilometers. Set it on whichever one you want. I'm gonna leave mine on miles. Once you're on it, just press the GPS button and you've successfully changed the units on your Garmin Instinct watch. At this point, you can simply press the back button or if you've got a hot key to take you back to your main watch face, you can use that. Pretty simple stuff. As always, I hope the video helps. Thanks for watching.